found that at the end of 2024, Lovable quickly became a category leader in AI app development, achieving 100 million annual recurring revenue in just 8 months after its launch. With Lovable, you can create a web app by just describing your idea in a chat box with plain English. Lovable offers decent integration capabilities and platform flexibility with the ability to use external databases and hosting providers. However, it might be the case that you are experiencing issues building your app in Lovable or just don't want to use it anymore due to some other reasons. And finding the right alternative is challenging as there are more than 30 similar apps right now on the market. However, I believe I've identified five main alternatives you need to know as they are not just lovable copycats but are doing certain things much better than lovable and are a better fit for a specific use case. Let's review them all. The first lovable alternative will work perfectly in case you are satisfied with lovable and its capabilities but you are frustrated by the friction it introduces when you need to set up Superbase for user authentication, integrate Stripe and other services. While lovable is one of the best platforms for external integrations, it might be confusing for non-technical users. Base44 is challenging this. They've built an all-in platform like Lovable, which also handles user authentication, database setup, deployment for you, all within Base44. I would say it's more user-friendly for non-technical users and is a better choice if you are just starting with AI native app builders. The drawback is that having everything within Base44 is less flexible, more risky in regards of technology diversification. Also, it might be harder for you to migrate outside of Base44 elsewhere later. Otherwise, I would say it has pretty much all of the capabilities that Lovable has. It's worth noting that Base44 isn't just a no-name tool. Its success might be even more impressive for some folks than Lovables. It was coded by a solo founder who founded it earlier this year and then grew it and sold to Wix for $80 million in cash just within 5 months. Isn't this crazy? They are now scaling the platform with more resources that giant like Wix has and I believe that with a founder like this on board and a professional team at Wix, Base44 has a prominent future and the potential of becoming the best IE app builder on the market soon. Alternatively, if you are frustrated with AI and its hallucinations, you can give Bubble a try. Compared to others AI native app builders like Lovable and Base44, Bubble is primarily a drag and drop visual development tool. It also offers some AI capabilities like Lovable has, but they are less comprehensive. When it comes to designs, most of the AI native app builders are relying on Shotsian components and most of their apps look templated. Bubble, on the other hand, allows you to achieve any design complexity, look and feel that you want. Also, compared to other AI native app builders that are mostly one to two years old, Bubble has been on the market for more than a decade, offers sophisticated functionality and can be considered more reliable. But Bubble comes with its drawbacks. First of all, it will take you a lot more time and effort to build your app just because developing apps visually with drag and drop is slower. On the top of that, Bubble has a steep learning curve. Another major disadvantage is that you will never have access to your source code and you will be stuck in Bubble forever. Finally, the pricing model is very different. While in most AI app builders, they charge you for messages that you use in the chat box to build your app. Bubble charges you for the app usage. The more your users use your app, the more you pay. With AI native app builders, you've built your app once and done. You don't have any additional expenses unless you decide to iterate with new features. Hello guys, I have a small announcement. We have recently launched a new service called Lemkin Prod where you can hire our team to help you finish the last 10% of your web coded project. So if you have a lovable app and you are stuck, you can go to lemkinprod.com, fill out the form and we will reach out to you with the next steps to help with your project. See you there. 
in case you are more technical and lovable browsers pisses you off because you want to have a more comprehensive tooling for a technical person like you, I would give Raplet a shot. Before the AI hype, Raplet was founded in 2016 primarily as a web-based IDE for developers. Therefore, it has more comprehensive code editing capabilities, collaboration features, development frameworks, and so on than other AI app development tools. Like Base44, Replit offers a database and other built-in out-of-the-box features. Moreover, Replit is one of the only AI app builders that offers a mobile app and allows you to wipe code apps using your phone. Also, I really like the project planning feature that Replit agent has. Instead of just building the app based on your first prompt, it breaks down the plan that you can modify before the final build. I'm in love with this user experience because it builds exactly what you need and sometimes I feel useless. It does all the job. Replit is the most popular lovable alternative and in my view, oftentimes personal subjectivity comes into play when some folks say they prefer Replit over lovable. So you just have to try both and then decide which one you prefer most. Now imagine lovable and Figma had a baby. That's Temple Labs. In one of my previous videos, I've explained why in my view most of these AI app builders are not suited for the design phase of your app creation. They lack a visual canvas feature where you can group all of the screens into holistic user journeys to make better user experience decisions. In that video, I mentioned that I would prefer using AI design tools like Banani or Magic Path. By the way, you can check that video, I will leave a link in the description. Temple Labs is the only AI app development platform that offers this visual canvas feature and it makes the platform unique in a sense and gives it a unique differentiator over other tools. An interesting fact about Temple Apps is that they offer done for you service where in their Agent Plus plan that costs $4,000 per month, actual developers from Temple Apps team use their AI development platform to design and develop apps for you. I haven't seen a similar offering in other AI app development tools before. If you are highly technical and you want to maximize the power of AI without limiting yourself, you should look at Cloud Code. You can think of Cloud Code as a companion that integrates into your coding workflow, Visual Studio Editor, local environment or even Replit. With Cloud Code, you can create almost anything with just plain English. And you are not locked into one stack as it supports more most popular programming languages. Cloud Code recently released sub-agents, allowing you to run your project with a full team of AI co-workers, architects, developers, designers, testers, or product managers. Using Cloud Code requires strong technical skills. You need to know how to structure your project, how to plan architecture, and how to deploy it. It's worth noting that many folks prefer Cursor AI over Cloud Code as it offers a complete AI coding experience with their proprietary code editor. However, since the recent pricing drama, many folks no longer see a reason to use Cursor AI and are switching to Cloud Code. To sum up, if you are enjoying using Lovable but are looking for an alternative that is easier to use, use Base44. In case you don't want to play around code and are fed up with AI hallucinations and are okay about spending more time on building your app and also not owning the source code of your app, you can try Bubble. If you want to continue building with AI in your browser but with more comprehensive developing tooling and also building development infrastructure, use Replit. In case you are used to Figma and want to get all from your designing workflow, use Temple Labs. If you are very technical and don't want to limit yourself in anything and are okay with the hustle required to achieve it, use Cloud Code. That's it for today guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video, comment, share your thoughts. In case you have additional questions, you can ask them in my community. You can join at vmakemvp.com slash community. And also, if you want me and my team help you with your app development, you can go to vmakemvp.com slash consultation and book a meeting with us. See you there.